Today I'm going over everything you need to do to prep your car for winter or winterize it whatever. That is, let's say you want to make it where it's ready to take off or if you want to store it over the winter. This goes for both. First, we're going to start with this. This is specific for diesels. This is the kind that I use. This is to help it from anti-gelling and I think it makes it run a little bit better. You probably want to use a funnel and follow directions. It depends on how big your fuel tank is and how much fuel you actually have in your tank. I also recommend getting a full tank of fuel. You never know when it's going to be too messy to go out to a gas station or it can be shut down if the weather's bad enough. If your vehicle's four-wheel drive, I highly recommend turning the hubs at least every four months and putting it in four-wheel drive because if not, these are known to actually freeze up and you don't want that to happen, especially when you need it in a pinch. Check your batteries. Make sure there's no corrosion. If, it, if there is, I highly recommend this stuff. Uh, you can actually get by with using like Coca-Cola. I've seen that break it down. You can use like baking soda and vinegar. But I like that stuff. It's just quick and easy. And then you can put this on as a protectant and it won't happen again. You wanna also make sure that you have the right cold cranking amp. Where this is a diesel, it is crucial that it's at least 750. If not, it's hard to start these in the winter time. You also wanna check your antifreeze. You can get a cheaper one of these. I just like this one because it's easier for me to read. But as you can see, this is good to almost negative 29 degrees. If you're ever known to put water in your windshield uh, washer fluid, highly recommend not doing that. That can freeze and burn up your pump. I recommend something like this. It's rain eggs, it makes the water beat up, but it's also a de-icer and a bug remover. And it's like four bucks. Don't cheap out on that. Your vision's important while driving. If your vehicle has a block heater, I will go ahead and test it and plug it in just to make sure it's working. Make sure you have good windshield wipers. If they look cracked or old or if they leave streaks, I will go ahead and get new ones now. Don't replace it while it's snowing outside and miserable check your tires as well you want to check your tread and make sure it's good if you're about to take off in the winter time always let your fuel pump completely cycle make sure your air's off your headlights everything let your vehicle have all the power that it can get from the batteries because it's crucial when it's cold that cold weather really takes a toll on the batteries and always let it go to operating temp or really close to it before you take off if you can help it because it really helps the motor. Lastly, make sure all your lights are working because it's very important for people to be able to see you as well. 